What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Seasider Spotlight. I'm Mick Miller with Jesse Hine. Jesse, first of all, man, you are looking good. How do I get my hair to look like your hair? You go to the beach all day and you get it messed up. That's how I think I see a little bit of sand on your face. So, wh which beach are you going to? Temple, bikini? What are we talking about? I did a Chinaman's hat this morning and then Temple Beach just to lay out in tan. Okay, cool. Sounds good. All right, 10 questions. You ready for this? Ready. 10 of the hardest questions you're ever going to encounter here at BYU Hawaii. I can guarantee you that. First one If you had to pee one superhero, which superhero are you going to be? I love Thor. He's just got the hammer. It's unreal. No one can no one can pick it up. Not even the Hulk. He's the best. He's basically a god, so he can't even die. Be honest. You just want to date Natalie Portman, don't you? It's true, and I want that hair. Okay, I see. I see. Okay, second one. If you could be a millionaire for one day, what big purchase would you make? Oh, that's a tough one. But um, probably a plane. Yeah, a plane. If I like a like like a jet that you could go like anywhere on the planet. Yeah, for sure. Okay, cool. Um, if you were arrested, if you were arrested and you had one phone call, who are you calling? Um, in my ward back home, we have a two-star general, retired two-star general. That was um, leader growing up, so definitely him. Yeah, Keith Thurgood. Why wouldn't you call your mother? She would just be crying. <laughs> we would know what to do. So. All right, fair enough. Don't call mom. All right, fourth one. I'm gonna get up all up in your business right now, and I want I want the I want drama. I want a fight at practice today. So, who is the strangest player on the men's soccer team? Probably Josh. No comment on that. Fair enough, Josh. Sorry. All right. More serious question. Who is the most influential person in your in your life right now? Um. I definitely have to say my dad. Yeah, for sure. He's uh, always making me chase my dreams. You know, I, I have the dream, but it's almost as if he, you know, wants it more for myself than, you know, than I do for myself. And it's just incredible how he pushes me and, and wants to make sure that I have no regrets and leave it all out on the line. 